UW Medicine's South Lake Union Research Hub, already home to several hundred scientists, will see 300 to 400 more in 2013 as a new lab building opens. The scientists are relocating from the main UW campus and other sites to a new seven-story lab building, which features distinctive exterior lines and interior spaces designed to promote teamwork and the easy sharing of ideas. We've been planning this about three years, and I can say that we are so excited to finally have new space. The campus there is just amazing because it has so many wonderful centers, a high-throughput screening center, a mass spec center, all kinds of different technological ways to look and help achieve real meaningful uh, uh, progress. We're forming a new group, it's called CERID, Center for Emerging and Re-Emerging Infectious Diseases. And we feel with the different kinds of expertise that we'll have over there, immunologic, drug development, uh, basic pathogenesis, understanding the host response, we'll have all of that together in one roof and really be able to be responsive to new and emerging infectious disease threats as they come out. The reason that we're excited to move down there is that a lot of our research overlaps with people who are existing down there already at South Lake Union and those who are planning to move down. But I think that the culture really has also evolved uh, around the building. That's one of the real attractions for going down there, rubbing shoulders, bumping into people, mm -hmm. and having that m much uh, uh, less fragmented community of investigators. University of Washington has a huge number of people that do vision research. At South Lake Union, the chances for interaction are going to be fantastic. There's going to be brand new laboratories that are custom made for vision research. So we think that this is just a fantastic opportunity. With the new programs, infectious disease, immunology, kidney disease, rheumatology, and vision science, UW Medicine has more than a thousand researchers at the South Lake Union site. Established research programs there involve diabetes and obesity, cancer vaccines, heart tissue regeneration, and several other areas of study.